Hi, I'm David Peterson, and in this video, you'll discover how you can take gorgeous photos without getting a new camera and without investing in expensive photographic equipment. Let me ask you a question. Have you ever wanted to take breathtaking photos like these? And I'm not just talking about photographs that would look great on the cover of Time magazine. But what about photos that highlight the memorable moments in your life, like birthdays, weddings, and yes, even little Johnny falling flat on his face? Surprisingly, it's profoundly easy to improve your photography. I'm going to show you how the professionals make their photos look so good. And more important, I'm going to show how you can start taking better photos in the next two minutes. And you don't need to buy a new camera. You don't have to invest in gear you don't know how to use. And you definitely don't need to chase down your wedding photographer to ask them how they did it. You see, the pros have a few tricks up their sleeve. They know how to keep you interested in a photo. And if you're intrigued, you're much more likely to think it's a great image. Here's one example. In this image, we're captivated by this toddler because we can see he's looking to the left of shot. And we know from the expression on his face that he's apprehensive about something he's looking at. As viewers, we're intrigued already. What's he looking at to make him uneasy? This engagement is what makes this image memorable. Now let's pull back the veil of secrecy. I'll show you the exact techniques used to make this photo interesting and how you can do this yourself. It might be hard to believe, but we only changed four things to make this a great photo. The first is the expression on the child's face. In your own photos, wait for the right moment to capture the emotion. Like a child reveling in a new experience, or a batter waiting for the pitch. To fully capture emotion, you need to get close. And that's the second element. Fill the image with your subject's face and you'll instantly enhance your photos. Use the zoom lens on your camera, or just walk closer. And when you think you're close enough, try getting even closer. By doing this, we're removing any surrounding distractions and make sure our subject's emotion shines through. Here's another technique. Don't place your subject in the center of your photo. Instead, place them to one side. This small composition change makes an enormous difference in our photos. For landscapes, place the horizon on the lower part of the image rather than right in the middle. It will create a more dynamic photo and add interest. Lastly, to highlight your subject, put the background out of focus. This usually happens automatically when you zoom in, but it helps if you set your camera to portrait mode. This way, the background doesn't detract from our main subject. Now let's revisit the toddler photo. Now you can see how these techniques have been used. We've gotten close to his face, so we can see his expression. He's on the left of the image, and the background is out of focus, so our eyes naturally concentrate on his face first. Using each of these four techniques on its own is enough to take a great photo, but when you put them all together, they can create spectacular images. And as you've seen, they're all super simple to do. In my Digital Photo Secrets video course, I'll show you dozens more tricks and techniques so you can record long-lasting memories of your next family vacation, your daughter's wedding, or the gorgeous rose in your back garden. You'll be taking mouth-watering images of even the most mundane subjects, like the cheeseburger you had for lunch, quicker than you can say cheese. Digital Photo Secrets video course is not a simple one-hour presentation either. I've stuffed over 12 hours of killer techniques and valuable insights into this course. After teaching photography for eight years, I understand what you want to know about how your camera works to get the shots that you want. It's a fun and informative approach to better photography. Are you new to photography? My videos build your knowledge over time so you won't get bogged down with lots of complicated terms or instructions. I take you step by step from the basics, like how to correctly hold your camera to eliminate movement, and how to compose your photo for maximum interest. We then decipher how ISO, shutter speed, and white balance work in harmony to help you get the shot you want. Have you been using your camera for a while? The Taking Control section covers intermediate topics like shutter priority mode, metering modes, and using EXIF to your advantage. And when you're ready, you can move on to more advanced techniques like using depth of field and taking stunning photographs at night. And there's more. To get you started quickly, I've got a whole section on situations. When you want a quick five minute primer on taking wonderful photos for some common situations, check this section. 
you'll see helpful techniques for when you're out at sporting events or weddings, or you want to take photos of sunsets, fireworks, or children. They're short and to the point, so you can take what you need and get going. Once you understand the fundamentals of photography, you can take gorgeous photos on demand, shot after shot after shot, without needing to learn any complex camera settings. To get immediate access to Digital Photo Secrets video course, just click on one of the green Order Now buttons below. You'll be taking breathtaking photos in less than 10 minutes. And if you order today, I'll include a 30 minute bonus video on using Flickr, the hottest photo sharing site online. I'll show you how to upload and share your own photos and use Flickr to learn from others. Don't be ashamed or annoyed by your photographs anymore. Start taking photos you're proud to share today.